Hello, welcome to my channel. And today we're going to be comparing two different types of Doc Martens. We're going to be comparing the low cut versions of Doc Martens. I believe these two are probably the best type of low cut Doc Martens. We're going to be comparing the 1460 ones to the 39. 89 the broach you know these two they're similar but different i feel like doc martens also have the 80 35s which look very similar to the 1461 ones so that's why i'm doing this type of comparison just to see the good and the bad for both and also if you have a pair of any of these please leave down in the comment section your experience with them so that it can help others out so when it comes to the 1461 ones i have the smooth leather with the white stitching around it and then when it comes to the 39 89 the brooch the wind tips i have the cherry red made in england i believe they're very nice clean and i'll have to say the doc martens 1461s they're one of those type of shoes that for the most part it goes with anything they're more chill they remind me of the 1460s basically a lower cut of the 1460s they go with a lot of different outfits while i feel like the 39 89 the wingtips the brooch they're more a little bit more classy more elegant so if you want to wear them it's more of a dressy uppy type of vibe that you're getting with them when it comes to sizing for both of them they're very similar or it's exactly the same i did not have to struggle trying to find my size with each they fit the same and i wear a size 9 and for me i didn't have to struggle with anything but if you're having questions or you're wondering what size fits you, this video or this one up here describes everything that you need. So go ahead and give it a watch and hopefully it helps you out. When it comes to breaking into these two type of Doc Martens, the low cuts are a little bit different. The reason why I say that is because most of your pain points are going to be at your heel, basically the back of your heel. And then since it's low cut all around that low cut, so your ankles might get a little bit of a beating like let's be honest depending on how it is and how strong the uh, leather is and how much pain tolerance you can take but for me it didn't take too long for me to break into them i felt like they were pretty simple and easy to break into usually i just wear some thicker long socks i don't do no show socks especially breaking into doc martens and gradually wearing it more and more made it very easy for me to break into these apart from my ankles another part was around like the toe box a little bit it was somewhat depending on what they are and if you have tight feet or like wide feet then it can depend on if your like toes start to hurt a little bit because it might feel a little bit cramped in there but for me it just hurted a little bit until i break into them and then they molded right into my feet it was very simple for me so these are my final thoughts with these two I really enjoy wearing both of them or having both of them. The Doc Martens 1461s, they're more and they can be more of an everyday type of wear shoes for me, like summer, spring, fall. I can see myself wearing that all the time, especially the color that I got is black with the white stitch and it looks a little bit special, unique. It goes with everything. And then the cherry red, the reason why I got the 39.89 is because I would say like more special occasion more if I want to stand out you know every time I wear them they are like oh wow people recognize them they look different they look nice and I don't know it just stands out and for me personally I feel like it's not something that I do want to wear all the time but when I do wear it I know it's like special occasion I feel good and it just complements the whole outfit since it's very bright and red the reason why i like it is that i don't have to dress up up i just make sure what i'm wearing at the top is pretty calm while my shoes are mainly the action like the statement piece of my outfit i know they also got it in different colors and things like that but the 1461s they got more varieties like if you want varieties and things like that i feel like the 1461s fit a lot of people that's what I think about the two. Hopefully I helped you out. If you have any questions, leave it down in the comments below. And also check out this video where I compared the 1461s to the 1460s. You're going to like it.